Hi beautiful people, in this video I'm going to show you that how we can fix uh, this WooCommerce checkout issue. Here you can see uh, when someone is go to click on to the any product and they come to here on the uh, WooCommerce checkout page then you can see here it is infinity uh, here uh, I mean here you can see the infinity loop is just uh, loading on the checkout page so people cannot click on to the uh, pay or going to purchase the product. So I tried all the methods, nothing was working. So then I figured out how we can fix that. So I decided to share with you. So if someone is going to face this problem, like my uh, one of the client is face, facing this is issue and I have fixed for him. So I just want to share you, share you with this tutorial that how you can actually solve this issue. So let me show you that how we can do that. Simply you have to go here to the, the, uh, the customize. I just go to uh, click under the customize here. This is going to be the short video. We're just going to add the uh, a CSS code. Then we're going to fix that issue very simply. Just click on the customize. Uh, there are so many methods we can figure out when a checkout page is not working and it's going to give the infinity uh, spinning a uh, low time. So there can be a lot of the uh, factors like you have to first check out if uh, just deactive all the plugins and make sure you have only active the WooCommerce plugin. And then if you see uh, the error is not encountering, it means there is an issue with your plugin. But if you have deactive all the plugins, but still you see this issue, then there can be uh, this solution for you. So how we can do that? Simply go to here, additional CSS. Here we can create the code. So scroll down here underneath. And I am adding here the code. Uh, here is my personal website. If I click on to the here on the, I have already posted here. So I'm going to copy from here this code and I will share the link below in the description. So you can uh, click on the link to uh, copy this code, CSS code, then come to here. And then we're going to put here the CS code. Simple, just click on to the publish. Actually here you can see another link because uh, the uh, my client is using the uh, Italy language, so that's why you can see this one. Otherwise, if you are using the English, you will see the publish option. So just click on this X icon. And now if I'm going to refresh the checkout page, it is automatically refresh. Okay, that's cool. But I just want to make sure again, just I will click on to here to refresh. And then here you can see uh, the checkout problem is solved. Now it, there is no infinity uh, spending loading time. So this is how we can fix this issue. And it was the quick. So I thought I have to share with you people so I can help you to solve such kind of the uh, problems if you are facing. Thank you so much for watching this video. And if you are new on my YouTube channel, don't forget to subscribe for more upcoming videos. Thank you. Bye bye. Take care.